Finkler. Wonderful, Guy Finkler. That is how you bring a dead ball to life. Superb. Well, I know he's hit that with the inside of the foot, but he's hit that with such violence. to his game, as he's proving here, as he tees up Fred, a bit of space to attack, Fred, 1-0, well it just opened up for Fred, also with the initial touch, and Fred was allowed to run free, and that's his free around Telstra Dome, it's the Brazilian brilliance which has put Melbourne a goal in front. Instead, he's going to carry it out, eventually uses the Scott, first time ball to Reynaldo, one on one, Reynaldo! He's got a double! Welcome back to the starting lineup, and the Raw are in front, 2 1. Oh, welcome back, Reynaldo. Welcome back, Charlie Miller. Fabulous play, Luke De Vere. Nijayevsky spotted the run from Zulo. He'll hear after this one and keep it in. Danger signs here for the Phoenix. Across it goes, and in it goes. There was always danger coming when Zulo latched onto that. And in it went to the Brazilian Bobo, an eighth goal of the season for him, and a 1 0 lead for Sydney FC. Looking to turn defence into attack, Mijayevsky. Here it is for Bobo, and it's rolled into the back of the net off the left foot of Bobo. Squared back into his path. He didn't get the greatest connection, but that won't matter. It won't matter at all to the Brazilian. Nine goals this season now and Sydney FC re-established their two-goal buffer. They, they, they create ugliness, they get results, and that's what this, this resolve. And this Sydney FC squad's got it. The Phoenix Here's Carly to Bobo for the hat-trick. It's a perfect hat-trick for Bobo. One with the right, one with the left, and now a header and a dagger into the heart of Wellington Phoenix. Three for Bobo, four for Sydney. Wrap it up and put a bow on it. Stick it under the Christmas tree. This one is all done. Well, it's going to be a nervous last 90 seconds for Melbourne victory. They want to keep the ball in this area of the park. Or perhaps even better, all the goalkeepers come out a long way. And Guy Finkler prods it into the empty net. Game, set and match. Melbourne victory. 3-1. Here's Sir Lawson Otis break away, Andy. Maybe a chance here for Brisbane. Enrique, it's 2-1. For Brisbane. Well, now we've got a grandstand finale. One kick separating Brisbane Raw from their second trophy of the season. Enrique scores! Brisbane are the champions! And who'd have thought we'd have been saying that some 10 minutes ago? Michael Tadzi. Pena picks out the bottom corner. And grabs a goal against Wellington again. As he is, Pena. Pena, oh, it's a lovely little touch, and it's a wonderful goal, and it's Murnane who adds his name to the score sheet. Pena just dancing through the traffic. There's not a lot of following of players in truth. Wellington already looked punch drunk. Docker. Docker. Still going. Docker! Oh, he's done it, the Brazilian! Well, it was going to be his night, denied by the woodwork in the first half. And in the first minute of stoppage time, his perseverance, his persistence was not to be denied. And Mikhail Docker, with four minutes left to play. Nazarene, 
Pena, a little bit of space opens up. Pena, like a bullet! Daniel Pena with a brace, and he puts Western United back from 2-1 down. They are 3-2 ahead. The Brazilian lining up in the United round. Norit Hendricks has taken over corner kick duties from Josh Belante. So it's the outswinger, and Marcelo attacks it! It is four! He missed one earlier on from a set-piece situation, but yet again, Western United simply did not deal with the threat. With the delivery towards Marcelo, he's done it! The captain of the Western Sydney Wanderers, with their backs against the wall, has finally got that second goal of the season. No surprise as it came from another towering header. Derby, where they were way too standoffish. And that's a great challenge. And then the chip, wonderful! What a brilliant goal from the Brazilian, Marco Tulio. Everyone back on their feet. It was McGarry, the man down, but he's okay. Silvera looking to launch a counter. Tulio's alone in the middle. Marco Tulio, can he get his step right? Yes, he can! It's a glorious finish! And the visiting Mariners score through Marco Tulio. Nezhayevsky spotted the run from Zulo. He'll hear after this one and keep it in. Danger signs here for the Phoenix. Across it goes and in it goes. There was always danger coming when Zulo latched onto that. And in it went to the Brazilian Bobo. An eighth goal of the season for him. And a 1-0 lead for Sydney FC. Milos Nukovic, Terry Antonis tracking the run. They worked it superbly, Sydney. Zulo! I think the final touch was off for Bo, and he has another one, the Brazilian. Make that 27 in 27 games. He is a machine.